Tampa Bay man pictured smiling and carrying House Speaker Nancy Pelosi's lectern during the Capitol riot right there says he's pleading guilty because he is guilty. That's Adam Johnson, who agreed to a plea deal in a D.C. courtroom this morning, and he's pot facing potentially months in prison. Fox 13's Gloria Gomez has been monitoring all the developments today. So, Gloria, how much time are we talking about here? Cynthia, I got to tell you, it didn't go very well for Johnson today. He faces up to six months in prison, and he may get all of it. The judge not happy with his behavior. Federal D.C. Judge Reggie Walton scolded Tampa Bay resident and criminal defendant Adam Johnson for his, quote, clownish behavior and called him weak-minded enough to, quote, follow a lie and do what you did. Hold him this way! This is what he did. Federal prosecutors say this is Johnson walking off with Speaker Pelosi's lectern and posing with it during the deadly riot at the U.S. Capitol on January 6th. This morning in a virtual hearing in a Washington, D.C. courtroom, he pled guilty to entering and remaining in a restricted building. The rest of the charges against him were dropped by federal prosecutors. As part of his plea agreement, Johnson is facing up to six months in prison and a $500 fine. Last time we saw Johnson, he was in federal court in Tampa, being released on bond with an ankle monitor. His attorney agreed early on the picture of Johnson carrying the speaker's lectern was a problem. Does he regret Again, any of it? Obviously, if we could turn back the clock, I suspect that, that, that he would. As the one-hour hearing wrapped up, the judge had a few more choice words for Johnson, saying he didn't understand Johnson's mentality for thinking this was a fun event to be involved in, and asked, quote, so why shouldn't I lock you up, sir? Johnson apologized for his regrettable behavior and told the judge, quote, I am pleading guilty because I am guilty. And Cynthia Johnson will be sentenced on February 25th in Washington, D.C. Again, the judge could sentence him to, to up to six months in prison. Of course, we'll let you know how it plays out. Back to you. We shall all see. Thank you so much, Gloria.